Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House. Today we're going to be making a new custom pony. We're going to be making one of Cozy Glow. She is a villain in season 8 of My Little Pony. Alright, let's go ahead and get started. To make Cozy Glow, I'm going to be using Fluttershy here because she is a Pegasus. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing we're going to do is trim off the hair. So we're going to take our scissors and then cut off the mane. And then, of course, we also need to cut off the tail. Next, we're going to paint her scalp. The color I'm going to be using is Rosebud. At this time, we're only painting the top of the head and the back of the neck. This is because we'll be baking the pony to dry the clay and the paint will fade from the heat. Now, we're going to make the mane. Taking two balls of oven baked clay, a blue and a lighter blue, we're going to blend them together. I'm going to flatten them out, stack them, and then roll them together a few times to get a marbled look. Next, we'll roll it out again one last time and then cut out a small rectangle. We'll then roll it up into a curl. The reason I'm using oven baked clay is because you can roll them out thinner and you can get more details from the clay. Air dry clay is rougher and small curls like this doesn't look as good. Also, the colored clay here is really nice to use to get that marbled two-tone color in the curls. Here we're going to taper one end for the side that is attached to the head. Before we add the curls, we need to place a piece of clay over the scalp. This is just a thin rectangular piece to cover the remaining hair and also to give some color to the scalp. Now we're going to add three curls to the front. On both sides of those curls, we'll add a teeny tiny twist of hair. Here in the back, we're going to do something similar. On the very bottom, we'll add a layer of small curls. and then layer larger curls on top. Okay, now we're going to make the tail. Doing the same thing as the mane, we're going to roll up a thin piece of rectangular clay into a curl. We'll need to trim the tail to fit the pony. To add the ribbon, we're going to take a toothpick and create a crease near the end of the tail, all the way around. Then, we'll roll out a thin strip of yellow to put it into the crease. On top of that, we'll add a little bit of ribbon. Now, let's add a yellow ribbon to Cozy Glow's hair. We'll start with adding a band to the top of the head. And then, we'll create the bow and place it right over her left ear. Looking at the pony right now, it doesn't seem like she has enough hair, so we're going to add one more row of hair in the back. Now we're ready to bake the clay. I'm not going to put it in the oven for the full recommended time. Instead, we'll just do 275 Fahrenheit for about 10 minutes so that the pony doesn't melt. Alright everyone, we finished baking the clay. As you can see here, the curls are nice and hard. However, over here, we burnt poor Cozy Glow's hair. Oh my gosh. I used a toaster oven to bake the pony, and the heat source was very close to this side of the pony. So we totally burnt her hair. It's a good thing her ears didn't melt. Let's try to save her. I'm going to use some sandpaper and sand the burnt part down. Let's go ahead and sand this part and see what shows up underneath. Okay, so underneath the burnt part is the clay, which is blue, so I think we might be able to save this. Let's go ahead and see what we can do over here. Bad news, guys. I don't think we can save the curls by sanding it. It looks pretty damaged. So instead, what we're going to do is paint the curls. This way, we can hide the burnt part. The first layer will be the darker blue. We're going to paint all the curls the same color.
And then we're going to add a little bit of white to the blue and then paint those stripes over the darker blue. Okay, I think we saved the hair. It looks presentable to me. What do you think? I'm so glad we didn't have to redo it. Next, we're going to paint the entire body. As you can see, the paint that we did on top of the head earlier is much lighter from the baking. Now the coat looks nice and fresh. Taking yellow, we're going to paint the ribbon on top of her head to cover up that burnt portion. Now let's finish the pony. Starting with the eyes, we're going to paint a large white crescent. Then we'll line the top of the eyes with black and add some lashes. Next, we'll line the bottom of the eyes with a darker pink and then paint an orange circle on the inside. In the middle, we'll paint black pupils. Then we'll add two white dots and three tiny white freckles. On the other side, we're gonna change it up and make Cozy Glow's angry eyes. This will be her villain side and make this a split pony. After painting the white, we'll line her eyes with black and add lashes, just like the other side. And we'll also line her bottom eyes. For the irises, we're going to make it a really small circle right in the middle of the eye. And add small black pupils right in the middle. Add some white dots. And we'll also add little freckles underneath. And the final touch will be that evil smile. Finally, we'll finish with a cutie mark, which is a chest piece. Let's put a cutie mark on both sides because this is the split pony. Alright everyone, we are done. So this was a very tricky custom since we burnt the hair and we had to kind of recover that. However, I think using paint instead of leaving it with the marbled colored clay is just as good. So this is actually a little bit closer to the show because the stripes are actually horizontal and not just marbled. So I think it turned out pretty good. So on this side, we have Cozy Glow in her cute side, her super happy cute side that you see in the beginning. And then on this other side, we have her angry side. Oh my goodness, look at her little evil eyes. Here you can see she is plotting to take over the school. What's really interesting about this split pony is that the only thing that's different are the eyes. So everything else about the pony is pretty much the same. So let me know down below in the comment section what you think of my split pony cozy glow. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!